I'm Kimberly Rocca. I'm a local Iowa City native. I actually was born on the East Coast, but didn't live there very long. So I grew up here in the Midwest, and I'm an artist. I'm abstract, impressionistic. So almost everything that I do has, although it's abstract, has a real touch of nature to it. I, I've loved art my whole life. My parents always had me doing something or other with projects and gardening and building things and remodeling and decorating and I ended up going to the University of Iowa and pursued art there and I got a degree in metal smithing, fiber art and graphic design and I studied with some really wonderful instructors. I studied with Chung Hee Chu in the metals. I studied with Virginia Myers in foil and printmaking and I studied with Nancy Purrington in fiber art. You know, back in the day, <laughs> there was no internet. And so to get influence, you really went to the library, um, you dug through pictures, and you went to museums and to shows and things of that nature. And that was wonderful, but I think what's become even more wonderful is all of the social media of all of the different artists all over the world. And as much as I love some of the greats, and of course Pollock is a huge one for me, but the throwing the paint everywhere. And um, uh, Richard Serra is big for me because of the large scale bending of massive metals and sculptures. And, um, and then of course, since I'm in home building and I design houses, uh, Zaha Hadid, pre-planning a piece of artwork to, to me is just, it's like putting myself in a box. And I just love to not be in a box and I love to explode all over the place. And I think that's where my art has really gone in more and more frequency of color expression. Um, and it just it's just energy on canvas. If, if I could, I would work as big as this wall. I mean, I have an absolute love for large scale work and it doesn't intimidate me at all. In fact, the bigger I get, the happier I am. These pieces I worked on the other day, this is part of what I'm doing for this show. And I'm on layer four of color. So sometimes these will sit for a year or two or three and sometimes they'll get buried and not come out for 10 years. When you're doing something that's so organically developed, it, it's hard to know the stopping point. Like you, you're kind of afraid to add more, but afraid that if you don't add more, you, you're too shallow. So there's this very delicate trying to be impress something upon someone, but do it in as minimal steps as you can. There's nothing more exciting than having people come in and just take in everything that I've done. I mean, that's hand in hand with the creation. Like how, how can you not love creating as much as you love giving? It's, it's like so intertwined that I, I love both aspects of that.